Hey there, welcome back guys. This video is for those that are running the latest Mac OS operating system. As you can see here, um, uh, you know, Apple lets you try it before the launch, right? So apparently the um, OS S Sonoma 14.0 broke everything. Um, at first it broke Final Cut Pro. I follow this um, YouTube video online on how to uh, get Final Cut to work because Final Cut was freezing. But now you probably don't have any inter internet and are like, shit, what do I do? Well, there's a fix for that. It's probably because you're running a firewall and a little snitch is the problem and you can't update it. So let's get started. I'm gonna, um, as you can see here, uh, this will get your internet back up and running if you're running a little snitch. And I had no idea, you can quit the app. Um, you might have luck if you delete the app, but there are certain elements in there that just break it. And I tried everything. It says you're connected to Wi-Fi, um, but it doesn't matter. You can still be connected to Wi-Fi. Apparently the little snitch protocols just are active, but inactive. You can't see it and that's what's broken. All right, so let's fix this. So if you have the, uh, this is on the M1 chip and it's a uh, Sonoma, right? 14.0. Um, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to, um, because you don't have any internet, you're gonna have to take this link and either have another machine running, somehow download it. Sometimes if you quit and, and then open the internet again, you may get lucky, but if that's, if you can't, that's fine. What you're gonna do is this, you're gonna go, this is a link to the new, uh, little snitch 5.7, uh, requires Mac OS Big Sur. Or later this is the nightly build version apparently you know they find a bug they fix it you're probably like shut up i just need to get my internet back up and running all right so you're going to go to um system settings right and then you're going to click on see where it says network okay and then from network see where it says vpn filters um where it says little snitch enable disable it okay once it's disabled, right, your internet will be back up and running. Hopefully, let's try another website. Um, Google. It took me hours to figure this out because I had it couldn't connect to the the, uh, the internet, right? So let's see, Pablo Pico. Yeah. Oh, that's weird. Let's try Google. Google.com, take away the voice. Yeah, so it's up and running. And let's see if YouTube's working. That's probably, because if, if Google wasn't What has God been to you, Tom? I've literally um, never seen you like this. I'm in love. What? I'm in love. There. Back to the splash page. All right, so that's it. This is the fix to get the internet up and running. Now, if you don't have little snitch installed and you're having other issues, you go into system settings. And then you click on the Wi-Fi, whichever Wi-Fi that you're connected to. Uh, and then you click on details. Okay. And then you go into the TCP IP. You can either renew the TCP IP. Everybody knows how to do that. Um, if that doesn't work, uh, you go into the DNS, 192.168.1.1. Instead, you have one, two, three, four, four brackets for four numbers. So if that doesn't work, put all eights in eight. Dot eight, dot eight, dot eight. That's it. And then um, for search domains, you can put um, google.com. Hopefully that will work. But this works with the little snitch um, uh, break. And that's it. Um, and that's when yeah, we don't, don't want to go there. I hope that this video helped you and you're better able to have a more connectivity with your internet um, and getting back up and running. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below or ideas for other videos. And I'll see you all next time.